Kentucky using only your sniffer. <laughs> no getting distracted by green food. I have hide it. <sighs> Come and find me. Now remember, Spike, listen to the sniffer. <laughs> Snipping Spike. At least Mr. Threehorn isn't green food. Huh. I'm not any kind of food. Uh, right. And I'd never eat you, even if you were. Oh, kids. Don't worry, Spike. You just have to keep trying. I am still hiding. Yes, yes, yes. I know you can do it, Spike. Come and find me, Spike. Remember, Spike, listen only to the sniffer. <laughs> <laughs> you find it, me, Spike. Yup, yup, yup. Way to go, Spike. <laughs> <laughs> Littlefoot? I believe he's gathering tree stars with Grandpa. This will be Chomper's very first time of great giving. Oh, how wonderful! Yeah, so what's it all about? Well, many bright circles ago, everyone in the Great Valley learned an important lesson about caring for one another. And now we celebrate being able to share with each other and not having to worry about sharp teeth. Yeah, I guess sharp teeth can be a problem sometimes. Yes, they're horrible, vicious creatures. Uh, I'm gonna go find a little foot. Uh, oh, but I, I didn't mean him. Chomper? Oh my. tree stars for the time of great giving feast. Wanna help? Nah, 
Us sharp teeth can't tell the good tree stars from the bad ones. <laughs> when I was a hatchling, sharp teeth kept us from eating the tree stars. <sighs> we had to eat swamp sticks. Ew. Chomper, come on! You don't want to miss the feast, do you? I guess not. <laughs> mm, nothing but green food. Chomper, sit with me. <gasps> <laughs> Come along, children. It's not safe to play with sharp teeth. Maybe I should go back to the mysterious beyond, Ducky. Nobody wants me here. Oh, no, no, no! The mysterious beyond is not safe, Chomper. It is full of bad sharp teeth, like Red Claw. Yeah, I know, but I'm a sharp tooth. Yes, but you are a nice sharp tooth. And you are our friend. You even teach us things you know. Like today, you teach Spike how to use his sniffer to find me. Yeah, I guess. You are a very good teacher, Chomper. You are, you are. Say. If I can teach Spike how to use a sniffer, maybe I can teach Sharp Teeth how to be nice! Oh, I do not think... Thanks for the great idea, Ducky! You're really smart! I am? <laughs> oh, thank you, Spike! Once I teach Sharp Teeth how to be friends, the mysterious beyond will be as nice as the Great Valley. Has anyone seen Chomper? I've looked everywhere I can see, and I can't see him anywhere. He left the Great Giving early. You said something about teaching Sharp Teeth how to be friends. Sharp Teeth? Friends? Me no like sound of that. Me neither. We better find him fast. How are we going to do that? We can sniff for him. Spike finded me with his sniffer, so he can find Chomper too. <laughs> I don't think Spike's able to sniff out anything he can't eat. Oh, but he can. Chomper taught him how. You can sniff him, Spike, I know. Your sniffer knows the way to go. Do it like you did before. And we will find him for sure. Go sniff him out. I do not have a doubt. You can sniff Chomper out. Your sniffer is... Chomper stood today. Okay, Spike, now sniff away. Look at that! He's got the scent. Show us where he went. Go sniff him out. You can sniff him out. Do not have a doubt. There can be no doubt. You can sniff Chomper out. Sniff and sniff him out. You can show us how. I thought I would have seen some sharp teeth by now. Oh, 
Oh well, I'll find some sharp teeth to teach tomorrow. <sighs> After a good night's sleep. Friends? Uh, right! Uh, you speak sharp tooth! Chomper went spike? Mm. Okay. Well, let's go. A sharp tooth! Hey! Over here! Wanna be friends? Earthshake! Wow! Lots of sharp teeth! Hey, watch the hurry! We can't be friends if you run away! I'll probably never be able to teach Red Claw to be friendly. Breakfast? No, look! Spike find it footprints! Mm. Chomper! Hey, somebody my own age! This should be better! Hi there! Want to be friends? If we're friends, we can play catch. I'll throw and you catch. Oops, that's okay. You're just learning. Easy there. We bite our food, not our friends. <laughs> Ouch! Hey! Hey, wait! Teaching sharp teeth 
this harder than I thought. There sure are a lot of footprints, but we haven't seen any shark teeth yet. Oh, that not funny. That great. Yeah, I'm sure Chomper's okay. a good idea. Chomper, we were, we were. We looked everywhere we could see for you, but we couldn't see you. So we had to smell for you instead. You were right, Ducky. You are my friends, and those sharp teeth don't care about me at all. And I can't teach them anything. <gasps> I've heard that sound before. We gotta get out of here. Ground move. What do we do now? Well, we can't stay here, that's for sure. Everybody jump! We've got to get down this mountain fast. Everybody, slide! Slide, Spike, slide! Me no slide, me fly! There's gotta be a better way to... Oh, wait for me! Enough. 
enough of this hard water to last me a lifetime. <sighs> well, at least we're all alive to enjoy our lifetimes. We better keep moving. Unless Chomper here can teach Red Clawness pal some manners. Oh no. I don't think I'm ready to teach Sharp Teeth how to get along. Or maybe they're not ready to be taught. Either way, I think we should head home. You left the time of great giving before we could give you your feast, Chomper. We found your favorite things because that's what you like. Wow! Thanks, everyone! Sound right. Yeah, where did it go? I see is the day in front of us. All I see is the day in front of us. Burning bright with a newborn sun.
this was here. I cannot see where it goes. It is all twisty and turned it. I wonder how far it goes. Well, there's only one way to find out. Come on. <gasps> wow! Would you look at that? big at all. <laughs> Me like it our special little hidden place. I've never seen this kind of tree. Hmm, it smells good. <laughs> Ew! You leaf eaters sure have a strange sense of smell. I think the tree sweets smell yummy. I think they do, too. I do, I do! Your sniffers must be broken. It smells so bad it makes my head hurt. Ugh, I'm gonna go. <gasps> Wait for me, Chomper. I can't keep an eye on you if I can't see you. We'll meet up with you after we're through exploring. Hmm. <laughs> hey, look! Spike thinks the tree sweets taste as good as it smells. Mm -hmm. This is good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I think I'll have another. Then another! And another! <laughs> good times, good friends, take a look at what we found. Good times, good friends, lots of tree sweets all around. <laughs> about the tasty tree sweets. But if we tell, everyone will want some. Sarah, you know it's not right to keep food a secret, but there aren't enough tree sweets here for everyone, so what's the use in telling them? Hmm, I guess you have a point. Of course I do. No need to make a big deal about a few hidden tree sweet trees. Eated too much. <laughs> Ducky, Spike, I was getting worried. Where have you been? We were playing toss the seed. Then you must be very hungry. I gathered these especially for you. <laughs> so much. It doesn't smell so bad anymore. <sniffs> Ugh. 
Still doesn't smell good, though. Then we'll just have to keep eating. Right, Spike? <laughs> Ducky, Spike, are you two feeling all right? You haven't been eating much lately. We have not been hungry. You and Spike? Not hungry? Uh, yes. All of the stop the seat playing makes us less hungry. <sighs> Mama, there's something Spike and I should. Oh, no! It can't be! Not here! Kelly no, the they're here! Oh. Spiders in the Great Valley? and the young ones to safety. The rest of you, fall in behind me and Grandpa Longneck. <sighs> Time to show some fast biters that they're not welcome here. <sighs> hey, you, fast biters. You all know what to do. Hungry and sorry tonight. Those sneaky fast biters got clean away. Oh, we've searched everywhere. They must have found a way into the valley we don't know about. It's been a long time since any sharp teeth got into the Great Valley. This is a very dangerous development. We've seen those fast spiders with Red Claw. <laughs> and Red Claw is the biggest and meanest sharp tooth of them all. So if they're here, he's not far behind. <laughs> then we need to find out how the fast spiders are getting in and out. Until we know, we'll have to keep an eye out day and night. <laughs> Spike, do you want this? Hmm? I'm not hungry. <laughs> what, Spike? What, what, what? <laughs> it's another passageway. But where does this one lead? Oh, no. oh, no. There's a second way out of our hidden place, and it goes to the mysterious beyond. Uh-oh. And that's not all. Fast spider prints. If the fast spiders got in here, then they could find their way into the Great Valley. That's how they got in last night. Oh, we leave now. Me scared. 
what we do now? We know how the fast spiders got into the valley. We have to warn everyone. But what if they get mad at us? I guess that's a risk we'll just have to take. <sighs> we made a big mistake. It is more than an oops eats. We've got to go. Tell everyone what we found here. Say you made a mistake. No one is supposed to eat the tree sweets in the hidden canyon. You say you saw footprints. Yeah, fast spider footprints. Children, how much of the tree sweets did you eat? Uh, a lot. What's that got to do with anything? Those tree sweets have a smell that sharp teeth don't like. In fact, it makes them sick. I believe that. But if there aren't many tree sweets left, the smell won't stop Sharp Teeth from coming into the Great Valley. What? Oh, no! Grandma, you warn the others. Mr. Threehorn and I will check on the Hidden Canyon. At least now we know how the Sharp Teeth got in. Well, there are still some tree sweets up here. Well, you can hardly smell them. No wonder it didn't keep the sharp teeth away. <sighs> we'll just have to find another way to keep the sharp teeth out. That screechy screech! The fast spiders are back! There's no time to get away. <laughs> Littlefoot, you and your friends go back and get help. Mr. Threehorn and I will make sure you get away. Yes, we can stop the sharp teeth, at least for a while. Now go. Play 
toss the seed. Let's go! Stand the tree sweets. Yes, Littlefoot. We have to make sure there's no way for Sharp Teeth to get into the valley. We can never, ever go back to our special hidden place. No, no, no. Now that the hidden canyon has been closed off, the Great Valley is once again safe from sharp teeth. My friends and I want to apologize for putting everyone in danger. We didn't tell everyone about the tree sweets we found. We so, so sorry. Well, you should be sorry. I'm getting too old to tangle with sharp teeth. But, Daddy, you are so brave the way you fought Red Claw. Oh. Oh, well, it was nothing, really. <laughs> there I was, face to face with Red Claw. Now, the trick to fighting sharp teeth is not to let them think you're afraid. So I marched right up to that big bully and I looked him right in the eye 